Dear students, welcome to Divya's Math Solutions. Today we are going to discuss chapter 4 linear equations in two variables exercise 4.2. Question number 1. Which of the following option is true and why? Y equal to 3x plus 5 has unique solution, only two solutions, infinitely many solutions. A linear equation two variable have infinitely many solutions. What is the reason? Because a line has infinitely many points. Correct. Each point is a solution of the linear equation. So we can say that a linear equation in two variable have infinitely many solutions. Because the line, the line has infinitely many points. The line means there is many points in this line, right? Every each each one is a point, right? So infinitely many points in a line. So each point is a solution of the linear equation. That is the reason. So we can check. Here the equation is y equal to 3x plus 5, right? For each value, when the when you are substituting the value of x, the value of y will change, right? If x equal to, just I am taking two columns, x and y means, if x equal to 0, what is the value of y? 5. If x equal to 1, the value of y is 3 into 1, 3. 3 plus 5 is 8. If x equal to 2, 3 into 2, 6. 6 plus 5 is 11. If x equal to 3 means 3 into 3, 9. 9 plus 5 is 13. Like that the value will change, right? That means infinitely many points on the line. That means each point is a solution of the linear equation. So the linear equation have infinitely many solutions. This is the answer. Question number 2. Write 4 solutions for each of the following equations. 2x plus y equal to 7. We need to write 4 solutions for this equation. So that means for we need to put the value of x and we will get the value of y, right? Any value we can substitute. So put x equal to 0. If, if x equal to 0, what is the value of y? 2 into 0. 0 plus y equal to 7. That means what, what is the value of y? y equal to 7. So the solution is 0 comma 7. So like this only we will represent the solution. right? First we need to write x value. Next we need to write the y value. Next we can put x equal to 1. If x equal to 1 means 2 into 1, 2 plus y equal to 7. That means y equal to this 2 we can shift. 7 minus 2 is 5. So the solution is 1 comma 5. Next we can give x equal to 2. If x equal to 2 means 2 into 2 is 4 plus y equal to 7. So the value of y equal to 7 minus 4. 7 minus 4 is 3. So the solution is 2 comma 3. Now we can give x equal to 3. x equal to 3 means 2 into 3 is 6. 6 plus y equal to 7 and y equal to 7 minus 6. 7 minus 6 is 1. So the solution is 3 comma 1. So the four solution of this, we can write the four solution of this equation 2x plus y equal to 7 is 0, 7, 1, 5, 2, 3 and 3, 1. These are the solution of this equation by 2x plus y equal to 7. Second one, pi x plus y equal to 9. Here also we can substitute the values for x. So we will get the value of y. That are the solution of this equation, right? So first we can give put x equal to 0. Any value you can put, okay? So pi into 0 is 0 plus y equal to 9. That means the value of y equal to 9. So what, so what is the solution? 0 comma 9 we can write. Correct. Next we can give x equal to 1. If x equal to 1 means pi into 1 is pi plus y equal to 9. So the value of y equal to 9 minus pi. So what is the solution? 1 comma 9 minus pi. Next we can give x equal to 2. If x equal to 2 means 2 into pi is 2 pi plus y equal to 9. That means y equal to this 2 pi we are shifting 9 minus 2 pi. So the solution is 2 comma 9 minus 2 pi. Next we can give x equal to 3. If x equal to 3 means 3 into pi is 3 pi plus y equal to 9. So the value of y equal to 9 minus 3 pi. So solution is 3 comma 9 minus 3 pi. So we can write therefore 0 9 1 comma 9 minus pi, 2 comma 9 minus 2 pi and 
3 comma 9 minus 3 pi are the solution of this equation pi x plus y equal to 9. Third one, x equal to 4y. We need to find four solutions for this equation. So, each value of y, we can find the value of x, right? So, first we can put y equal to 0. If y equal to 0 means what is the value of x? x equal to 4 into 0 is 0. So, the solution of this equation is 0 comma 0. First, we need to write x coordinate, then y coordinate. 0 comma 0. Next, y equal to 1. If y equal to 1 means x equal to 4 into 1 is 4. So, the solution of this equation is first 4 and y is 1. Next, y equal to 2. y equal to 2 means x equal to 4 into 2 is 8. So, the solution is 8 comma 2. Next, y equal to 3. y equal to 3 means x equal to 4 into 3 is 12. So, the solution of this equation is 12 comma 3. First we need to write x coordinate then y coordinate. So finally we can write therefore 0 0 4 1 8 2 and 12 3. 12 3 are the solution of the equation x equal to 4 y. Question number 3. Check which of the following are solutions of the equation x, x minus 2y equal to 4 and which are not. So which one is a solution, which one is not a solution. So how we can check? The equation given is x minus 2y equal to 4, 0, 2. So the value of 0 means this is x and x equal to 0 and y equal to 2. This value we need to substitute in this equation then we can verify. If LHS equal to RHS means what we can write? This is a solution. If it is not means what? This is not a solution we can write. Correct. So first one we can check. 0, 2. That means x equal to 0 and y equal to 2. Correct. So this equation become LHS we can write LHS equal to 0 x is 0 minus 2 into y is 2. So we will get 0 minus 2 into 2 is 4 0 minus 4 0 minus 4 is what minus 4 right minus 4 minus 4 is not equal to what 4 right. So LHS not equal to RHS. So this minus 4 equal to 4 means what we can write this is a solution but here the LHS is not equal to RHS. Therefore, 0, 2 is not a solution of this equation. Therefore, 0, 2 is not a solution. Next, second one. 2, 0. That means x equal to 2, y equal to 0. Here also we can substitute in the LHS. LHS means left hand side of the equation x minus 2y. x is 2 minus y is 2 into 0. That means 2 minus 0. 2 minus 2, 0 is 2. Here also what is the LHS? This is not equal to 4. That means LHS not equal to RHS. So what we can write? 2 comma 0 is not a solution. Therefore 2 comma 0 is not a solution. Solution of the equation x minus 2y equal to 4 we can write. Third one we can check. 4 comma 0. That means x equal to 4. Y equal to 0. Here we can take LHS of the equation. LHS is x minus 2y. That means 4 minus 2 into 0. That means 4 minus 0. That is 4. 4 equal to. This is also 4 right. So the 4 is equal to what? RHS. So here we will get LHS equal to RHS. That means what we can write therefore. 4 comma 0 is a solution. Is a solution of this equation x minus 2y equal to 4. Fourth one root 2 4 root 2. That means x equal to root 2 and y equal to 4 root 2. So we can substitute the values in the LHS of the equation x minus 2y. x is root 2 minus y is 2 into 4 root 2. That means from these two equation, what is the answer? Root 2 minus 4 into 2 is 8 root 2. Root 2 minus 8 root 2 is what is the answer? Minus 7 root 2, right? How we can find? From this equation, we can take root 2 as common. Remaining is 1 minus 8. 1 minus 8 is minus 7 root 2, which is not equal to 4. So, what we can write? Root 2 and 4 root 2 is not a solution. Root 2 comma 
for root 2 is not a solution of this equation. Is not a solution we can write. Next 1 comma 1 that means x equal to 1, y equal to 1. In LHS we can substitute the values. x minus 2y that means 1 minus 2 into 1. So 1 minus 2. 1 minus 2 is minus 1 that is not equal to 4. RHS is 4 right. So what we can write therefore 1 comma 1 is not a solution of this equation. Is not a solution of this equation we can write. Fourth one. Find the value of k if x equal to 2, y equal to 1 is a solution of the equation 2x plus 3y equal to k. The value of x and y is given. This is the, this x and y is a solution of this equation 2x plus 3y equal to k. We need to find the value of k. That means directly we can substitute. Substitute x equal to 2 and y equal to 1 in 2x plus 3y equal to k. That means this equation become 2x. That means 2 into 2 plus 3 into y. That means 3 into 1 equal to k. 2 into 2 4 plus 3 into 1 is 3 equal to k. 4 plus 3 is 7. 7 equal to k. That means what we can write the value of k equal to 7. This is the answer.